Hello, Opie Pals! I am Jonan54, and, uh, well, I said I was gonna do a vlog every month, and, um, uh, this is my way of continuing my attempt to try to keep that promise. So, what am I going to talk about today? Well, a multi- uh, multiple things. I mean, if you remember that click- Get some help. If you remember that clip from the February blog, and of course, the cherry atop the sundae. Probably a poison cherry. I have a junior research paper to do. I, 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 I want to die. Yeah, how's that going right now? Well, needless to say, the bulk of it is done. Um, my rough draft has been submitted, and um, by the end of the month, it will be no more. I will not have to do anything related to a giant research paper for the remainder of the school year. So, that's all, that's all nice and well, but there's probably going to be a, a lot of things I'm going to have to revise. But for me, revision is a lot easier than original composition, so shouldn't be too hard for me. Uh, as for everything else, well, uh, let's see, where should I begin? Well, uh, let me see here. Yes! Okay, so... Right now, as we speak, I was uploading Season 4, Episode 8 of Jonah the Four Reacts. Uh, that being the Friendly Neighborhood Spy Ops. And it appears to have just finished processing. Um, most definitely not uh, 50 FPS quite yet, but obviously this video is going up a day or two afterwards, so... By then, it should. By then, it should have 50 FPS. Huh, <sighs> so... Uh, as for other videos that are coming up, well, uh, my Easter specials are coming up, and what I plan to do is I plan to have um, Super Dynamic Gaming and Super Dynamic Gaming... Blah, 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 Super Dynamic Gaming's brother, Bruins98, um, over, and we're gonna play some SpongeBob SquarePants Lights Camera Pants. I highly doubt that anyone uh, who watches me now was, has been around for that long, but if you have, you would remember that back in 2014, for Easter, I did that same game, uh, and I also had a funny skit at the beginning, um, the first of many that I've done for specials and other things, um, and I was pretty proud of it, and at the time, that was my longest video. Um, pretty funny to think that... My longest video uh, at that time was that video, which was 32 minutes and 3 seconds. And now my longest video is the best of 2016 Mega Highlight Reel, that being 2 hours, 44 minutes and 53 seconds, I believe. Uh, regardless, that is an insane uh, change. Of course, it had been nearly 3 years in between. Um, and obviously, there were some videos that broke records in between then. Um, but that would be the, just one of many big differences between that video and the video that we'll have uh, for Easter. Um, another one of the big differences being recording software. Of course, I was using my old Kodak camera. Do I have that? Do I have that with me? Yes, I see it. I see it. Hold on. It's right here. This, this sucker right here. Um, Collecting dust. As you can see, the lens has certainly seen better days, but those better days were the days of that Easter special before I actually broke the lens. Uh, but that didn't stop that didn't stop me from recording with that uh, camera for another year and a half until I got the camera that I'm using right now, which will be the one that I use for a face cam. Uh, another thing that I didn't have back when I was doing that Easter special. Um, and I will be using Elgato in combination with my AV to HDMI to record the video. Um, and it will be uploaded in 720p 60fps. <clears throat> Uh, and another thing is, well, the editing software. Now, back when I was doing that Easter special, uh, I was using iMovie. And to be fair, the edits that I was making 
back and at that point, iMovie could handle him, but iMovie can't do 60 FPS, or at least the version I was using couldn't. Um, and to be fair, I could use Final Cut Pro, um, but that, that editing software it will take getting used to, and I don't see much of a point in using that software when I already have Adobe Premiere, and I'm already used to using that software. And that will be the software that I obviously use, and it's been the software that I have been using since March of 2015. Ah, so I'm excited for this Easter special. Uh, it makes me surprised to feel that we're already more than a quarter of the way through 2017. It just feels like yesterday that I was crying at the end of Pokemon Sun and Moon. Ah, times, good times. But as for other things, I did mention the skit at the beginning of the Easter special, and I already announced the Easter special reaction, that being Racist Mario. Uh, now, I'm not sure if any of the three people who are who will be part of the cast of the other Easter special, uh, they're going to be the cast of the reaction to the Easter special as well. I'm not sure if any of them have already seen Racist Mario. I'm pretty sure at least one of them has. But regardless, it's a fun video anyways, and we're gonna have reactions to it regardless of whether or not we've seen it before so regardless it's 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 something to look forward to and on the subject of skits uh, well that'll be the surprise at the end of the video uh, now let's get into the main event um, that I really wanted to talk to talk about uh, it happened last week on Thursday and uh, of course I have to be give a backstory to it so uh, in case you don't know I'm actually like well, let's just say I'm a tryhard when it comes to school. I am currently third in my class. There are 264 kids in my grade. Uh, I'm a junior in high school. Um, <clears throat> and yes, I'm third in my class right now. Um, very, um, not, not too far off from second, but I'm pretty far off from the number one. Um, and one of the things that has helped me um, boost my abilities when it comes to school is I am on my school's math team. Um, now, you're probably already making assumptions on what this might mean for who I am, but believe me, the story that I'm about to tell you will sway those beliefs before they even materialize. So, we've had a lot of interesting experiences with uh, math meets before, but the one that happened last week was definitely one I will remember forever. Um, <laughs> Now, this one was sort of a face-off for me. Um, it was basically like... It was my math team against uh, another math team from the same school that I go to. Um, now, we, we were competing against like 30 other schools at this math meet, but we didn't really care. We weren't we were going for victory because th this was uh, like... Um, I, I guess this is the equivalent of an intramural, intramural. It didn't really count for anything, so it was just for fun. But we decided to have our two best uh, teams compete with each other. It was the team of the five best freshmen against the five best everyone else. So we referred to them as the Fab Five and the best of the rest. I was part of the best of the rest. Um, and uh, everybody on the rest of my team and on the other team, we're all hard, hit we're all hard hitters. Um, and by the way, shout out to uh, both teams as both teams score first place in their divisions this year. GG to everyone, including myself. I, I, I was part of the team too, guys. I deserve some of the credit. Um, but basically, like, I knew, like, regardless of whether or not we won, we were going to have a good time because those, though, it was a Jeopardy style math meet, and those are always a great time. Um, so. Uh, we actually had, like, um, I brought them into my shop, uh, both teams, and had them take pictures, and then I'm gonna turn that into a movie poster, and that's gonna be awesome. It's gonna be like a Captain America Civil War edition, except instead of, um, Captain America Civil War, the math team Civil War. United, we stand. Divided, we sit down and show work. So... Yeah, I, I did that, then we went to the school, did the meet, um, now, I, I'm not gonna touch on this for too long, but, uh, yes, my team won. Um, but it didn't really matter anyway to me, because 
well, it it was it, it, I was happy, but so many other amazing things happened afterwards that I, I it was just completely overshadowed. Like you would not you would not know the type of experiences that we experience on the math team until you're on the math the math team. <laughs> so uh, we went over to a plaza for dinner after the math meet, um, and. Uh, we were in the, we were about to park in the parking lot. I wasn't really paying attention to the road because you know I was I wasn't driving the bus. But <clears throat> you know I uh, look out and I see I'm I'm looking at what restaurants that I'm looking to go to. I spot the five guys and immediately like that's my destination. And all of a sudden I hear ah! I look up uh, and the teacher who's driving the bus is like. And so, someone, after like five seconds, is like, what was that? And he's like, I guess we're parking here. <laughs> to be fair, it was like actually a parking spot, so <laughs> kudos, I guess. Uh, we walked out and the back tires were entirely covered in snow. <laughs> uh, but we didn't, really didn't care because we were all hungry. And, uh, you know, we went into our respective restaurants, went back. Uh, and we were, all, all the kids were back. Um, at the time that we were supposed to be back at the bus. Uh, but it took like a full, tw yeah, 25 minutes for the teachers to be back. <laughs> we, wa we walked up, one of us laid on the horn. <laughs> Another one opened the window and like, hurry up! <laughs> it was pretty good. Um, uh, so then we are like, uh, you know what? Uh, yeah, let's go back to the school. And then, um, you know, the engine started, we're about to head back. It's like, and then we hear, we're like, oh, right, the snow thing. Uh, so we had to uh, get the wheels out of the snow. And it was not as simple as it sounded. Because <laughs> it, it, it eventually devolved into we had to start clearing out the snow from the wheels using an empty pizza box in our feet. <laughs> then we had to get back behind the bus and push it. Um, <clears throat> then, then we walked back into the bus, and within seconds of us driving out of the plaza, lightning started flashing, so we, we, we cut up pretty close. And we got back to the school, and oh my god, that was, it, it was absolutely amazing. <sighs> that is definitely an experience I will, I will remember forever. Uh, and I have one more year of the math team to go, and I want to make it three in a row that my team has won first in our division. I, I feel like we have a chance. There are a lot of hard hitters on our team, um, but a handful of those hard hitters are graduating this year, so I don't know how we're going to do, but the Fab Five, as I said, they're very good, and we're going to have them on our team next year, so I have high hopes for the math team next year. Um, so yes, that would be the story as to why math team is worth it. Um, among many other things that I do too. Um, that, that, that just prove how much of a ridiculous nerd I am. Like the Skills USA competition I have near the end of this month. That's gonna be fun. My category? <laughs> Related technical math. It's gonna be fun. I'm in it with the person ranked first in the class, so it's gonna be awesome. And, yeah, that, that would be the story. Now, uh, for those who have stayed this long, what will the surprise be? Well, um, after the reaction is uploaded uh, next week, I am going to start releasing uh, a series of skit videos uh, that will introduce the characters to the reaction series. As you may be noticing, uh, I am building up uh, sort of a story arc in the season now, and... I feel like each character needs its intro. Uh, each character needs its introduction into the series. Uh, so I'll be doing a handful of those uh, for next week, uh, including there will be one for Jodan 54 the Reactor, there will be one for um, Modon 54, and there will be one for LFN Jodan 54. Those are the three that I have planned. Um, <clears throat> so there you go. I hope you're excited for those. Uh, I certainly am, 
I'm gonna have a blast recording of those. So, with all of that said, keep looking forward. I will see you next time. Bye-bye.